Hey everyone, Foxo back again with episode 4 of my Hogwarts Let's Play. Um, and I'm with Tuesday still. I've also started another character which I want to play in the Let's Play, which is Wednesday Adams. I love that film, Wednesday. And I try to make her as good as um, I could to look like Wednesday. <laughs> But not quite, but anyway, um, I got her to pass this level that Tuesday is currently on, so I'm going to record just a bit of this exploration of Hogsmeade. So let's Rebellion. carry on. And it's only level 7. But hopefully, yeah, level 8 now, cool. <laughs> I can't remember what gear I've got, let's have a look. I don't think I've got any extra gear. Yeah, I haven't got any extra gear. I think I've sold it all. But yeah, I'm thoroughly enjoying this game. I've been playing um, with my other character off camera. Look at the owl. So we're going to have a mooch round. See what we can find. Rebellion. Don't go. Oh, look. That's why that we really owe. Oh, we really owe. You know, number one. <laughs> oh, rebellion is the most used spell. Let's have a look. See what we find in here. I think there is some stuff in here. We can find. <laughs> there you go. That's a good way of getting your XP up. It's reveal all the time, rebellio all the time. <laughs> Nothing here. That plays a tune. No, it doesn't. <laughs> That's so cool. Rebellion. Nothing here. Have a look up the Nothing pops up. Don't push when I pushed it. Rebellion. <laughs> uh. uh. Oh, something beeped. Where did it go? Oh, I don't hear anything else. Oh, here. Yeah. Look at that, nearly missed it. Oh, another one. Akio. Ah, no, I've got missed it. There it is. Oh. Hey, pussycat. Free lock. <laughs> I haven't got a clue how to um, unlock them yet. I presume there's a spell you get later on where you can unlock the um, locked doors. I think there's a mini game involved. There is a way around that if you don't want to do the mini game. You put the game into story mode and that way you can open them. Oh, there's another paper. So it's worth just running around exploring, it really is. You find loads of stuff. Does it get any more cosy than Hogsmeade? Doesn't it? <clears throat> At the moment, because we're still tied with um, Natty, if I go too far out of Hog Hogsmeade, it warns me that I'm 
about to abandon it. Oh, look at this. Look. There's stuff that was mine there, but they're too far away. Hmm. If I jump down there, I'm going to die. <laughs> Oi. Let's go and have a look up here, see what's up here. Even though I've run around a lot with Wednesday on my other character, I still can't remember half the stuff that I found. It's just because I follow my nose, I don't have any plan. I just follow my nose like I told you before. Oh, I remember this. Only when I see it again. Rebellion. Oh, another page, look up there. So that's challenge complete and it brings up another challenge when that happens. See, I've got to find more pages, so it just exponentially gets bigger. Where are we? Challenges, there we go. Fuel for five pages. See, there's that one, that's complete. This this one, it started again. Once you complete the previous one, it goes off to the next one. So we've got another 13 to find. So it just carries on. What else we got here? Collection. Um, that one, that one, and that one. Just to clear the exclamation marks. Didn't miss any down the bottom, did I? Found quite a bit. That one. Top hat. Ugly. <laughs> and there's the eggs we just found. Ashwinder eggs. No more on there, no. <clears throat> Inventory. Plants. There we go, the eggs again. Okay, just keep looking. When you're running around, that music slowly actually does get a bit irritating. I dare say you could turn it off. Oh, um. Another mural here. But not there. <laughs> so cool. Magic hammer. Right, let's see what this says. <clears throat> I did do this. <clears throat> I think with them. Um, what did I? No, I can't remember. I can't remember that. I don't know where that is. It's up a path somewhere, so... <clears throat> They're supposedly meant to be quite close, but the ones in the castle aren't that close, actually. I haven't photographed that one. <clears throat> Is it up there? No, not down there. I'm trying to see if I can see it. This path the ways. Oh no, I've already forgotten what it looks like. <laughs> anyway, let's run through here and see what we see. Rebellion. If anything. Hmm. Probably going to give us a warning in a minute. There you go, abandon that city. We can't go there. It's definitely worthwhile having a look round before finishing the quest line off. Try and get him I'm gonna try and get him to level ten before finishing the quest line. So it's once you've finished those two that show, Pippin's Potions and the Magic Neap, <clears throat> you've got to go and speak to Natty again. And then that will um, progress the quest line. 
So let's look at that again. Wow. Lumos. Why has that gone like that? It's a bit weird. It's not showing again. Why isn't that showing? Maybe it's a bug then. It's the first time that's happened. Hmm. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Is it? Oh, look at that. That's <laughs> so cool. The visuals are really nice in this game. I love them. I need a invisible visibility spell to be able to loot those boxes. I think we'll get that later on. Rebellion. Yellow doors, I don't think you can go through. Yeah. Please, we can. Flutes and loots. Let's have a look what's in here. A cake. <laughs> Revelio. I didn't look at. That's down. That's down. Well, that gives us a lot more. Cool. Yeah, we need to sell all this before we uh, run out of space. Um, this is the smallest space we have. There's only four. I love the fact that the paintings are actually moving. <laughs> well, the image is in the paint paintings. It's so cool. Rebellion. I keep looking for pages in the sky. Oh, there's some money there, I think. indeed your field guide I'm <laughs> most pleased to be included <clears throat> cool just took a sip of me coffee oh can we go in there let's have a look no look I don't know if I've been in here with him because I remember obviously coming in here and I obviously not 
I remember coming in here with Wednesday. Oh, there's one here, look. Eat that. <laughs> the animations they, they put when you eat some stuff. There we go. More XP. Me, level 9. Oh, look at this. You got a sweet Rebellion. tooth. You soon get fat, keep on coming into this shop. What's that? Oh. God, it's a long time since I've seen Floss. <laughs> I do remember Flossy when I was a kid. Any more showing anywhere? What does this food do? <laughs> uh, I didn't try that before. Rebellion. Oh, there's another one. See, you got got to do this, guys, all the time. Get some dosh as well. Oh, I remember this. <laughs> it's that cool. Hot mint. <laughs> hmm. Locked. Yeah. You got a sweet tooth and coming here, you'd never leave, would you? <laughs> okay, let's carry on. Wait a minute, do you go up here? Rebellion. Have a bit of cake. I didn't do anything. Oh, pipe. Pipe. There's another one up there, look. Just up there. Let's go grab that. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Wait. I think it's the other side, isn't it? Wait. Oh, I can't do that anyway, can I? Yeah. Well, I'm stuck now. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, it was up here somewhere, wasn't it? There it is. Accio. Oh, I'm not close. Ah. Accio. Got it. Come on, get the owl, though. <laughs> I can't remember if I found something in the uh, water mill there. Let's go and have a look. And you can swim. You can actually find stuff in the water, actually. In certain areas. Oh, can we go in here? I oh, know, it's got a lock. Oh yeah, this is where the uh Does he come back? Let's have a look. Lumos. Oh, it's back again. Uh, trap. Wait a minute, that's down below, isn't it? It's down here. So oh there he is, look. See him on top of the post? 
How close that was? Cool. There we go. That'll give us some more XP. Lovely. Is that one done? Hogsmeade, here I come. Well, we're already in Hogsmeade, huh? <laughs> Building up there. Hmm. Let's go have a look over here. I oh, know that'll take us back out, wouldn't it? Yeah. Don't need to use a gate. Okay, nothing around here. Oh, no fights. Accio. Got him. I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Brood and Peck said a customer lost a Deeracle around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got us in a lot of trouble. Well, very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Uh, instead, I just wasted our time. There you are! Ha! Huh, finally! I'll have enough for that wind wisp. Ah, well, <coughs> not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over... Revelio. Never mind, I'll fix it. As always. Hmm. I'm going there. If it thinks it's got half a chance. Wizard wear. Now, at the moment, he doesn't talk to you. <clears throat> he won't talk to you until later on. I discovered that with Wednesday. I think there's a. Yeah. Somewhere in here. There we go. <laughs> uh, cool. Rebellion. Hope you're not finding this series boring, guys. But um, you know, it's a lot to do. You can't miss out on this. And it's just exploration, really. Looking at everything. <clears throat> Into that. <laughs> okay. Cool. Society will be thrown into the midst of unrest. What's that one? Can we go in there? No. Oh, we can. What's in here? Oh, it's the post office. We're nicking from the post office, look. <laughs> some more gear. I'll have a look at that in a minute. There should be some more gear. There we go. This shoot. In the post office, magically sorted various bits of mail. There we go. Three, level ten. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Let's get to the next person. Spiffin's potion. So, the quickest way to get there, use the map. Find out where Pippin's potion is. Um, switches, Ollivanders, we've done. Tunes and scrolls we've done. Where's the oh, potions, it's got to be that one. There we go. Just right click on it. That's it, and that'll take us to it. Use V. Okay, cool. Let's get there. I wanted to get him to level 10 before I finish this off. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Do the bits first, because what I want to do is... Rebellion. I think there is one here somewhere. Oh, there's another page outside as well. There we go. Right, let's... 
change that gear first. That's one level up. That's five levels up. Okay, cool. So we'll we wear that one. <coughs> Any more? No, everything is normal. One handle. Yeah, we've got that one. Okay, cool. Anything else? Collections. Just get rid of the exclamation marks. Okay, now we can chat to him. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me <clears> say <throat> it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Cool. What can I do for you today? Eduris potion recipe, we'll have that one. A oh, wise decision. We'll have that one. Thank you. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. I will, but... Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Okay. I want to sell some crap. <laughs> Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. It's the best when you can. Try and sell everything. Now, what I want to get from him... Where are we? Yeah. Get some more of these. Um, I can afford them. So we'll buy all three. A wise decision. Thank you. Because we're definitely going to need them with me. <laughs> uh, I'm always getting hit. Okay. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. That's good. We've got 13 potions. <laughs> All right, let's go to the other one. Visit the magic deep. Neat. <clears throat> I think that's right on the outskirts. Um, there we go. Put a marker there. And let's go to it. There we go. Now, where's that page? There's a page there. Oh, there we go. There's a page there. Oh, where's it? Come on, come back. Oh, in a bag. Some dots. Uh, another page under the bridge, look. Cool. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, here we are. Well, hello there. Anything here? Revelios. Yeah, cool. Oh, hello there. Please come in. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. The <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. 
I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo! Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Absolutely. Let me guess, you're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. <clears throat> now let's sell some stuff. Well, that's everything. Right, Better go and find Natty. Got nothing to sell. I thought I had something to sell. No one can say I don't keep a stacked shelf. Me and Natty at the tender centre of town. Okay, there's Natty. So if we press V, that'll give us a halfway to a quickest way straight that way, but we'll go and follow the path. <clears throat> we might see something on the way to correct. Rebellion. Not yet all. That lit up men, I thought. Handy having this little wheel. Yellow brick road to follow. <laughs> just keep revelioing as you go through, just in case something pops up. Oh, I thought it was a page then. There she is. That's Katty. Revelio. Nothing else. Okay, let's have a chat. Ah, <clears throat> I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favourite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I've fought it before. <laughs> Keep at it! We have to wear it down! <laughs> Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. I love the combat in the game. It's quite a bit of getting used to, because um, you, you can use the camera or you can mark them. But if you mark them, oh, you're locked uh, on uh, them, so... A moment if you would. 
it's I will see awkward. what he wants. Hmm. Go repair the damage first. Well, let's do repairio. Repair it. <laughs> so cool. What's that over there? Is that anything? No, it's not. But we can repair that. <laughs> so cool. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Wouldn't it be cool to have this in real life? <laughs> if you have a crash with your car, you can soon repair it. <laughs> repair it. Yeah, repair it. Repair it. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Repair the statue. It's got a page there as well, look. Revelio. There we go. Repair. One more to repair somewhere. Where is it? Ah, over there. Cool. <clears throat> That's so cool. I thought I saw a page here. Let's have a look. Revelio. There we go. Cool. I love, love exploring and finding stuff. It's so cool when we get the spell to be able to sneak up on those chests. Because they hold a lot of dosh. Right, let's go and have a chat. <coughs> See, now it's open. Now we can talk Hello, sir. Him. I don't believe we've met. <coughs> Allow me to introduce myself. Uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. <laughs> and as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. <coughs> Take your time. We've got to put it on just to... You won't be disappointed. <coughs> That's a glad... ...to get through the uh, quest. And then I'll get it off, because it's obviously lower than what we've got. No, so just to clear the quest line, put it on. That's it. And now we can take it off. I suspect you have a sharp eye for facts. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, butter have beer. at least one butterbeer. Butterbeer sounds cool. we head to the cool. three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way, then. I wonder what butterbeer would taste like. Butter? Worthy items. butter? <laughs> should you be inclined? Let's uh, put our stuff back on. Um, which is that one. There we go, and we can then get rid of um, stuff we don't want. That's what I would suggest always doing. You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. So let's sell all the crap first. I think there's only one, is there? Yeah, just... Oh, it's zero anyway, but it clears it. If I haven't said it before, it's a pleasure doing business with Let's you. See if there's anything we can buy of a reasonable price, which gives us a bit more stats. Oh, that's a bit expensive. If you want to buy that? That's 500. Hmm. We don't want to spend too much money yet. Well, it gives us 19. Um, 17, defense. Yeah, that'll be cool. Um, 200, yeah, we can afford that. 
to it. Bye there. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad rags promise. I suspect then, you have a sharp eye for fashion. Put it on. Yeah, puts our defence up quite a bit, so that's what we're lacking in at the moment. Cool, no trait applied. Don't know how to use the traits yet, because we haven't got them available. So we just sell that. Let's just sell it. Stop by whenever you're about. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. That will give us 60. Cool. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever okay. you're about. I will do. Thank you. Pull an attitude to the broomsticks. The three broomsticks, I should Assuming say. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. I do like these cutscenes as well, they're so cool. Ah, right. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. I love the dialogue. <laughs> Very similar to Elder Scrolls Online. It's so much dialogue in this game. It's so Did cool. Did they see us? <laughs> I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Three broomsticks. <laughs> the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Butterbeer. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Oh, oh. timely. I think they've done this really well. The expressions on the uh, NPC's Was faces... Was that I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. So not to cool. worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the calibre of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Look at the expressions on their faces. I said, so my friend is busy. Really realistic. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Imagine the work it's taken to get those animations. Butter beer forever. So cool. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. 
Some I quests have open objectives with no compass path. Set a personal waypoint from the map to track your own location. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Talk to Natty outside the three brute sticks, but first let's have a look in here. See if there's anything that we Rebellion. can grab. I think there is if I remember rightly. I don't remember exactly where mine. <laughs> oh, here we go. There's one. See, to get the XP, it's so worth looking around, it really is. And they've done so much artwork in here that you just got to look around and look at everything. This is why I think I'd love to have a first person view, because you actually see more. Oh, someone's texted me. Revelio. I don't think there's much more in here now. Oh, there is some bags upstairs. Periwinkle top hat. Ah, I don't like the top hats, but um, we can get their stats. What I do is I wear it and then put it as invisible. But we'll do that later. Nothing else here? Yeah. At least back out. So look up top. Okay, locked. Level one lock. Okay. Back down. Call that one. Rebellion. Rebellion. <laughs> I do love the spell casting in this game, it's so cool. <clears throat> Why do you keep looking to the right? I'm certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. You must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Press M to accept. <coughs> Select the Hogwarts map button to switch the Hogwarts map, which is that one. Pass travel to your common room. Which is, um, where I don't know, I can't remember. <laughs> it's the south wing, I think. There we go, that's the fast travel point. Fast travel to your common room. Just click on it. And it will pull us back. And it shows us waking up. This is where I'm going to call this video. Because I'm going to play my favourite character from this video onwards. Or the next one, I should say. <coughs> Quest complete. Welcome to Hogsmeade. Cool. Let's do a save. F10. Save game. Manual save. Save complete. Okay guys, I'm going to call it the call the video here. Hope if you have received an outpost. Okay, I'll look at that in a minute. <coughs> it's going to go to it anyway. Come and see me, I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. Okay. <coughs> Hopefully that'll be in uh, the other one as well. Um, I've saved it, so we're going to escape. Go to settings, exit to main menu, yes, just want to show you what I'm going to be playing on the next one, next video is going to be Wednesday Adam, there she is, 
I was hoping I'd be able to wee. I was hoping I was going to be able to get her with her locks like you see on Wednesday. The, the Wednesday film is one of my favourite films. I love Wednesday on that. Wednesday had them. It's so cool. So this is what I'm going to be playing for now on. She is obviously level 11. Um, not as high as um, Monday. But she's got a reasonable amount of DOS. And she's at the same level now as Tuesday is. So that will be for my next video. So I hope you enjoyed this one so far. But this is my favourite. I like her. So I'm going to be playing her on um, through the Let's Play. So I thank you so much if you got this far with me, guys. And I'll catch you in my next one. So see you soon.